Good afternoon. My name is Jay Stephen Levine with Levine Law Group. I want to recognize uh, Trevor Barone with uh, Brown & Brown Insurance. You need a good insurance agent. He's your man. In fact, my daughter's condo, she's on the board in Miami Beach, not far away, has used uh, his services. So uh, you'll, uh, you'll enjoy. I've been practicing law since 1976 doing association work on a, a consistent basis and as my main area um, since 1980. So I'm hitting close to year 40. I've seen a lot of changes, especially in the Condominium Act, because um, I helped to write some of it. We'll be talking about some of those provisions today. Um, if I can take you through your packet, that everybody has. There's the board certification outline with note taking. Then you're gonna see the fair housing outline and the key there we'll be talking about will be pets. You have to prepare a budget annually, although a lot of documents say if you're late, it rolls over to the next year until you adopt the budget. You're really then amending the budget. It's a budget amendment because the old budget started as the new budget. I'm not a fan of rollovers. Uh, if your documents say you have a rollover right, I think you're okay. If it doesn't say that, make sure before January 1, if that's your year, you have your budget adopted. Emergency powers. Remember that term after Irma, where the governor declared a state of an emergency for 90 days, uh, and then you were uh, running uh, on a skeleton set of restrictions because the law lets you dispense with a lot of formalities. There are some possibilities where even a private community might have to deal with ADA. If you have a rental program um, where they come to the office and they place people, like a lot of mobile homes have it, home, mobile home parks, um, that could create ADA because the general public can come and go by the day or by the night. Um, if you have a clubhouse that is frequently used by outside groups, like the Rotary Club and men's club, stuff that has nothing to do with your association, a bingo from outside of this bingo law, be aware that you are limited on what you can do in bingo because you have chapter 849 that tells you what you can and cannot do if you're gonna have a bingo operation. 